Justin, as I think back to when I first saw you at the taproom bar just about six seven, or seven, seven years, years ago. ago. It is a vivid memory I will never forget for one obvious reason. It was the beginning of our perfectly imperfect story. I could have never imagined how God was about to work in the coming years to be sure we got to this very moment. Through every challenge, every tear, every laugh, every prayer, we have officially made it. When I saw you in the moonlight, I just have my place. Lawrence, we made it. It was almost seven years ago on a cold October night that I was introduced to you at the Rochester Tap Room. A beautiful, blue-eyed, blonde-haired girl with a smile that caught my eye a few weeks prior. I was so nervous. As I was pulled to the side to meet you, I never thought I was being introduced to my best friend, my wife, the future mother of my children, and someone I would get the blessing of growing old with. After all these years, it's hard to pinpoint the exact moment I fell in love with you. Of course, I can go by the first time I told you I love you, but truthfully, I don't think I knew what love was at that moment. To me, I did not discover true love until I learned to be loved by God. The list of things I love about you is too long to share, but here are just a few things that come to mind. I love your smile and the twinkle in your eye every time I see you. I love the sound of your laugh as it immediately puts a smile on my face. I love how much you care about the people in your life and you're always willing to give helpful advice to those who are in need. I love how goofy you can be around me and I love how you never miss an opportunity to dance when the music is just right. Y'all see that later, so. <laughs> Most importantly, Lauren, I love the way that you love me. It's hard to have a bad day when each day will begin and end with you. I vow to love you forever and always. Though I didn't feel ready to commit right away, I could tell you were different in the best way. You felt like home, and it was a feeling I had never experienced before. We bonded over food, adventures, and late night jam sessions to JT, talked for hours, and never stopped laughing. With all of that said, thank you for being my safe place and a shoulder to always lean on, for your patience, especially in the beginning. Thank you for making me laugh every single day and for being my best friend for loving me through the hardest, most stressful years of my life, and thank you for always believing in me when I didn't believe in myself. You've made me a better person, and I'm so proud to be your almost wife. Such a great baby. But even more grateful that I get to love you and be loved by you every day. Lauren and Justin, I know your faith is strong, and it's something you both hold close. The faith I know will help strengthen your love for the rest of your lives. Treasure each other, love endlessly, and always walk hand in hand together through life. to the newlyweds, Lauren and Justin. I wish them a happy and healthy long life together full of endless love and laughter. Sometimes I see the journey back there. Sometimes I wanna go. Read the light in from my memory. Let the truth be known.